She don't go nowhere. And it's not because there's something heavy on the end. Do you see that? Okay, so uh, I took my hair off the style yesterday and I was supposed to wash it. We didn't get there, so. Um, the furthest I got was just taking it out of the style. So I'm planning to wash it in a little bit, but um, not right now. <laughs> I still got a little bit more stuff to do uh, before we get there. So I was thinking about just wetting it because I haven't wet it in weeks. Like she feels, she feel a little dry and she looks a little dry and skinny. So I'm gonna give her some love and wet her up with just, you know, some water and a water bottle. Um, I don't need a gas bathroom. That's why you hear the whole fan thing. I don't know how to turn that off. I have to dig in there and get it off because it's like cemented in. I'm not doing that. I did just wake up not too long ago. That's why we're a little manly right now. So I just wanted to show you guys. Spritz a little water. Oh, that's so kind of get it to open up a little. To the next side. She's starting to come alive. You see that? It's a little difficult to do with one hand. Mm hmm. Yes, mama. Yes. I missed you. I've been locked away for so long. <laughs> And she grew a decent amount, so I'm quite happy. So I think I'm gonna do a race this time after I wash her. She needed that. I'm actually quite happy. The majority of the hair stayed in the lock this time. She got five. And she got a little body. Oh, look, my curls is coming back. You see that? They were just so dry and dusty, and now my curls are coming in. Ew. Look at that. Yeah. Look they're coming in. Just a little bit of water. Ew. So, that's it. Coming out. It's fine. Fix it when I do the retwist. So, yeah. Now they're still coming back in. I guess I just needed a little water. She was really dry. It's coming together. I missed you. Oh. Yes. Serve me. Yeah. But she does need a little wash. I got all this edge control that I had when I got the edges all out. I did kind of retwist the front on like water when I um, styled it a little um, to redo this, this uh, style when it was coming apart, coming loose. So that was it. But for the most part, that style was it. It was everything. I kept it in that style for like ever and it was wonderful. I didn't have to do anything. So I think I'm going to do that again. That were loose started locking. That I guess was loose and now it's like locking and it's super thin. More power to you, boo. Whatever you want. That's a show. So, sum up the gypsy curls I had, I guess stayed. Some of them started to lock in the style, which I'm not upset about. Do whatever you want, honey. As long as you happy and you look healthy, do whatever it is you want. Mama approves. See that though? They're catching bodies. And get the little snickle. So I'm quite happy. It seems like they grew quite a bit. The hang time, I don't know, maybe I a little bit more where I had the hang time I just don't remember because it's been in a style for so long 
I don't know. Either way, I'm just happy to see them again. So I'm gonna give them a good bath later on this afternoon and, um, and retwist them. That's it. So I'm about to finally wash my hair. I've been saying I'm gonna wash it, I'm gonna wash it, I'm gonna wash it, and I never did. <laughs> so now I'm actually gonna do it. Um, since I took out the hairstyle, as you can see, it is super dry. The only thing I've done is put water on it, which is bad. So um, I'm about to wash it now with the shampoo that I got from my optician and. Um, <clears throat> I'm of course going to be moisturizing it with my Opalex conditioner and the hair perfecter. I'm also going to go in with a little bit of Jamaican black castle oil, peppermint oil mixture, and then some Nizani Miracle Milk. But the majority of the products that I have are all mixed in to this spray bottle that I'm going to be using. As you can see my towel right there, I'm gonna wash my hair. Um, when I retwist, because I'm planning to retwist my hair today. And today I'm gonna be using, instead of the flaxseed oil that I normally make, I'm gonna use Lion Locks, um, the locking moisturizer. I've been wanting to try it for a while, mostly because of the ingredients or something that I can read <laughs> and I know exactly where they are. And whatnot so that's what kind of pulled me to it it's a lightweight locking moisturizer so i'm gonna try this one i was thinking about either that one or the firm one but just to give it a shot to try it um i decided to go with the lightweight one and see how that works on my hair because i am planning to put it back in a style and um leave it there like i did before because that was awesome after which i will be putting my hair under this bonnet that i got from amazon because the one that i had she broke and I had her for like years man. years like <sighs> she's my baby I had her from I was in middle school when I got her so yeah she finally died on me so instead of me buying a big one I just decided to get this one and hook it up to my regular dryer just so that I can walk around the house <laughs> if I wanted to without having to sit because I hate sitting for so long it bothers me um, and then I have, of course, you know, my clips that I'll be using. So, yeah, I still have the string from when I took my hair out and everything. All I did was just put some water on it. And that was basically it. So, yeah, I'm gonna wash right now. I have a lot of growth, as you guys can see. She grew very well while she was in that hairstyle. That's partially why um, my locks were coming out because not like coming out, but like it was like coming out of the hairstyle per se. And um, I don't mind my face, I am hot and I did oil on my skin because she was dry and I went for a walk. Well, not necessarily a walk because I was more so in the garden. So, but yeah. Um, so that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to wash my hair. I'm gonna come back and then put the mixture in of the stuff that I showed you guys, the conditioner and stuff, and then begin twisting. Okay, so this is what we look like. Freshly washed. This is how it is. Freshly washed. Everything is still intact, even the one, where is it, right here? that came out it's still there it's mostly dry so I'm gonna let it kind of dry a little bit and then um, I'm gonna come back and do start my retwist um, I miss her oh my gosh she feels so clean and I only washed her I washed it three times the first time I didn't really get anything out so I washed it the second time instant lather that shampoo is everything this shampoo that I got from my optician, Karen. Baby, you know what you're doing. You know what you're doing. I love it. So, my scalp feels super clean. I really love um, 
the tingle that I got. It has tea tree in it and I think peppermint oil. I felt the tingle. So I think there's peppermint oil in it too. Yeah, there's peppermint oil. So, so now I'm about to step out real quick. I have to run a quick errand and then I'm gonna come back. Like I said, I'm gonna be twisting my hair with lion locks. That's what I used to rub my body down. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm gonna use to retwist my hair. Probably just gonna like throw it in a braided style or something like that. It lasted me very long. I have a lot of lint from the towel, but it's fine. Oh no, sorry, false alarm. That's just where it's wet and it looks like lint on the camera. But in real life, there's nothing except where the hair is coming out from the root. You see a little white ball. Ain't nothing I could do about that though. You stuck with me for life. I can't stop touching it. I've been touching it this entire time. When I was washing my hair, I was like, I missed you. Ah, I missed you. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, so let me go and run my errands real quick so I can come up. Get her did right now. I tried doing the barrel twist and I just did a braid here. And I sealed it with a rubber band and put one of these on. These little jewels and um, this old thing. But this is what that looks like. Show the other side. Alright, so I decided to try to do um, barrel twists because I really like the way that it looked and the braid kept coming out. So this is day four that I've, since I've done my barrel twist, I wanted to wait to make sure, <laughs> I wanted to wait to make sure that it wasn't gonna come out because the last few times I've tried to do barrel twists, came out like right away so this one has been holding thank goodness sorry um I keep moving my hand this one has been holding thank goodness and I did like a small braid instead of a twist this time I wanted to try something a little different um I think this side kind of grew out a little bit more do you see that do you see how it's basically even but it's just the way that I slept I'm not gonna lie and it's already kind of like growing out do you see and I did it so that it was like taunt on the scalp do you see that right there inches honey inches so yeah that's how it's been this my friends was twisted with lion locks and I did it with the one that had the light hold and surprisingly enough we still going strong um very very strong i wasn't expecting it to be this good i mean everyone's been raving about it people have been liking it a lot so i'm pretty sure that it was good don't get me wrong but i love it i love it it doesn't have that like crunch feel to it but it has a firm feel to it and it's not um the firm one so i think i'm gonna try the firm one as well maybe on my next one when I'm done with this bottle because this one seems to be doing it and you know Miss Mama's is staying in place so I'm not upset about that at all okay so you know we're in a happy spot right now um I have been spraying it like every few days maybe I feel like me doing less is more for my hair so when I was doing more I feel like I kind of low-key started damaging my locks because um like I noticed that the new growth was not as thick it wasn't giving me as much it was it was harder for me to like keep my hair in the lock when I do less she don't go nowhere did you see that and it's not because there's something heavy on the end do you see that Cheers. 
Okay, back on the topic. Yeah, I was just doing less. I was literally just psh, 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 and I noticed a big difference. I started taking vitamins. Well, I started taking a different vitamin, I should say. I changed the tea that I was drinking. Now I'm drinking ginger tea. Before I was drinking like ginger garlic tea, which is buzzing, don't judge me. Now you throw a little honey, throw a little lemon in there. That's it. That's it. But now um, I'm trying to slow down on my garlic um, a little bit. I still cook with it. I still put it in everything. But I'm trying to slow down on it because people are, are tired of it outside of me. So we're trying something new. That's basically it. Outside of like a few switches, like instead of spinach salad, sometimes I'll have kale salads. And I kind of notice the difference. I see it in my hair. I see it in my skin. Um, so yeah, that has been major um but other than that that's it it's been in this style i intend to keep it just like i had it last time for two months baby and live my best life because she is for me she is for me i probably missed it with a little bit of water today i did oil it for the first time since i did do my retwist i want to say a few days ago i guess because my scalp is not used to being um exposed that is basically it for this 